I just don't enjoy driving, you know, so I'd really rather just ride my bike. I talk to people all the time, they say, oh, I remember riding a bike when I was a kid, and it's like that every time you get on a bike, it's so much fun. You know, a lot of people say, oh, well, it's cold, it's rainy, it's windy, whatever, but any bike ride is better than no bike ride at all. People say, oh, well, you're always smiling, it's because I'm always on my bike, <laughs> you know? You know, I just started riding bikes. I was teaching my kids to ride bikes. This is on the New River Trail. And I started riding more and more, and then I started riding to work, and then I started riding every weekend, and I started riding, you know, more than that. What do you think it is that is so terrifying to people about riding a bike? What is oh, they're it afraid of all the cars. Okay. They're yeah. afraid of being hit by a car. That's I mean, you know, yeah, most yeah. people would say, oh, I would I'm, I'm love riding bikes, I'm afraid of being hit by a car. Yeah. I, I could see it, yeah. 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 I mean, but they're not out to hit you. I mean, would you hit somebody riding a bike? Well, no. Okay, well, <laughs> we'll see. That's what I'm saying. The classes are to empower people to let them know the possibility that it is totally fun, is not death-defying, to ride your bike wherever you want to go. And so you see how that can be helpful because you need to be prepared to stop at all times. I mean, it's better to do an emergency brake and know how to do it than fly over your handlebars and land on top of a car. Okay. You do have to have a healthy respect for traffic on the roadways, and that's what we do in the three-hour classroom portion, follow up by a three-hour on-bike skills portion so that they can actually execute these things. And then we follow it up with a road ride or a ride around. So we explain everything in real life. Instead of seeing it in an animation or in a movie, then they can experience it real time. You know, I hadn't been here for weeks, so I don't even know what I need. Okay, I'm all done with my list. Now I gotta get my trailer. This is my trailer. This is where I'm gonna put all my groceries in. When you're riding a bike, you're, you're doing a lot of different things, right? You're doing route planning. You're doing, you're looking at the weather, you're planning ahead. See, there's my little thermometer right there. That's how I get dressed. So tonight is gonna be 64, 68 to 64. So I'm gonna need um, some gloves and arm warmers and a neck gaiter. It's just like life. If you can break it down, right, then you, you, can, you can do whatever you need to. We generally are not on arterial roads unless we need to be. So you have a more scenic, pleasant ride and you can see other things and connect the city in a different way. It'll be more fun. It's like you're riding by everybody's house. A lot of people will say, oh, I only ride on the trails now. Or they mountain bike because they don't want to ride in the road. And it's like, but the roads go everywhere. If you're not going to get on the road, you're not going to go anywhere, right? The main thing that you can do to help climate change is to replace our car trips with other forms of transportation, whether it's biking, walking, public transit. Most trips that people make are usually less than five or ten miles, and it's not hard to ride five or ten miles. So, you know, that's why we do the Tuesday night ride, is to get people over all of those obstacles. Happy Tuesday! Happy Tuesday! Happy Tuesday. Welcome to uh, the Tuesday Night Ride. Uh, we have five rules. Uh, repeat after me. Uh, stay in one lane. Stay in one lane. Do not pass the leader. Do not pass the leader. Uh, be prepared to stop at all times. Be prepared at all times. Use both brakes. When, uh, when braking, use both hands. And follow all traffic lights and signs. Follow all traffic lights. Perfect, great job guys. Right, tell me when you're ready, okay? You ready? Okay, we're gonna let these two cars go and then we're gonna go, okay? Now we're giving them an opportunity to get more confidence to ride on the road with a group and then we'll give them the confidence to ride by themselves. I mean, because if I can do it, anybody can do it. Because I am not an intimidating person, I'm not a you know necessarily an athletic or fit person, I'm not a mechanical person, but you can ride a bike because they're that simple and it's that easy and it's that much fun. I mean, I always have fun on my bike. 